morning, everybody. It's 849 on this nice Monday morning, uh, August the 14th. And this is your pre-opening comment. It is video number 1872. Okay, so there's not a lot of, uh, well, there's no economic news this morning. Um, and uh, we have Asia a little lower and we have Europe kind of mixed to lower. Uh, China is down pretty big uh, because there's uh, talk about a, another bankruptcy in their uh, home and apartment construction companies. So real estate again. And um, the ruble, which was about one and a half cents before the uh, Ukraine war, got down to about um, 0.007. So basically a little more than cut in half. And then, you know, has been rallying back up. But right now it just broke 100 again, which would be one cent. It's 0.0099. Um, and the low, as I said, was 0 0.0077. So there are some problems there, and we'll have to see what happens. Um, also, in the news, Big Steel, symbol X, um, received a takeover bid, unsolicited, um, by uh, Cleveland Cliffs, CLF. Um, it was over the weekend that the news came out this morning. It had closed at seven at twenty two seventy two on Friday, got up as high as twenty nine ninety six this morning. The last is um, up about six and a half at twenty nine oh five, up about twenty eight percent. Now the deal is, it was seventeen and a half dollars in cash plus 1.023 shares of Cleveland Cliffs. Uh, Cleveland Cliffs is roughly unchanged, um, and so that works out to be about $32. Um, I'm not sure whether they've outright refused it, uh, but they have said that uh, they are looking at other alternatives. So... We'll have to see how that goes. And a little baby one, Z-Y-N-E. Um, it's a little biotech. Um, and it had been as high in 2015 when the company came out, as high as $43. And that is not an adjusted high because uh, of a reverse. Uh, that was the actual high. In the middle of July this year, it traded at 25 cents. Today, it has a range of $1.21 to $1.66 on the deal. Harmony, H-R-M-Y, not our H-M-Y gold company, is buying it at $1.10 and a half, 1.105. And if you're curious why it's higher, it's because of the structure of the deal. It is that uh, about dollar ten and a half per share in cash, and they have some conting contingent value rights also, uh, equal to about a hundred and forty million dollars. We're seeing a lot more of this, especially in the biotech area, where a company gets bought. Uh, but they'll get paid a little better if, in fact, they do what they think they can. Uh, as far as the markets this morning, um, the Dow was up about 50, then down 18, currently down 21 and a half. So still pretty quiet. NASDAQ up 33 to uh, minus 5, um, and the S&P up 7 to minus three and a half. So uh, S&P is now down about four and a quarter. Um, Dow, as I said, now down 24.40. 
Um, and I'll have to get back to you on the NASDAQ because the crawl just stopped. Okay, we also have AMC. Judges order that they can, in fact, issue some shares. Um, they didn't have any more room, so what they're going to do, it looks like, is they're going to reverse split the stock so that they can deliver the other shares. Um, not really well received ape ape which is that preferred that was is going to be convertible two dollars and 22 cents that's up 44 cents remember it came at five but obviously it has been lower amc which has gotten pounded got pounded last week after that run-up on the fact that they weren't going to be able to issue more shares this morning Three dollars and fifty-five cents. That's down a dollar seventy-one, or thirty-three percent. Okay, uh, down twenty-five forty in the Dow. Down six fifty-seven in the Russell, and down three and a half in the S and P. Okay, the chart on the screen is the oil. Um, you know, I wrote that I expected it to be lower. There are a couple of reasons, and Iran is one of them. Um, if you recall, uh, the last time that uh, a U.S. administration had dealings with um, Iran, it was Obama and Biden, and they shipped about $600 million over to them uh, in order to kind of buy the result. Well, we're now looking to get back five people, which optically looks just great for Biden. Um, but we're giving them back $6 billion. It's assets that were frozen here in the U.S. Um, I'm also thinking, and this is completely just my thought, have not read anything about it, Nobody's talked about it. I think that he's probably going to try and make a deal for some oil since they have yet to buy back a quart of crude, let alone uh, the 350 million barrels that are out of the reserve. So we'll see. Um but uh, I was looking also here at the stock. If you read my, uh, if you read my comment in last night's letter, uh, you would see I was looking for it to turn down. Anyway, we're right under this red line, which is the hundred-week moving average, right up into where we broke down from the last time. Um, you know, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven weeks of higher highs and higher lows. That makes it overbought. And if you look here at the RSI, it is absolutely about to turn back through the downside. So we're now 81.85. That's down a dollar thirty-four. It would be real nice to come down here to about the 78 area and um you know, start back up. There was a Fed um, former president, uh, Kaplan, was on CNBC this morning uh, talking about the fact that he thinks that we are still um, over five years from peak crude consumption. So, um, you know, everything is going to take longer than we expect, as always. There will be problems, as always. So uh, this, I expect this to be higher, but, you know, if it got anywhere near the 77 area, 77 and a quarter, I would have to be long the XLE. Um, other grains mixed, corn down, soybeans up, wheat down down, oats down. As I said, the oil is down about $1.30. Uh, 
heating oil down two and a half cents, gasoline down five and a half cents. Gold is down another five, down 0.038 in the silver. Uh, copper is down a penny and a half. Um, cattle and stuff not open. Uh, cotton, coffee, cocoa, sugar, all lower. Uh, I take that back. The cocoa is actually up a little. Um, the dollar is up 40 cents back over a dollar three, almost a dollar three ten. Uh, Bitcoin down a little, Ethereum up a little, bonds down three. So there you go, folks. Um, that's about all I have for you. Uh, a last minute look. We have uh, the uh, S&P down 530. We have the Dow down 35. 40 and down about 15 and a half in the NAS. Be careful out there.